absolute peach to get Meg Lanning. The Scorchers, they're just hanging in here, and the wicket of one of the best players in the world is certainly going to help. Packing those stumps just held up a little bit in the in the wicket here, and Meg Lanning had previously a lot, had been bowled a lot of that hitting the top of off. She can be a little vulnerable there because she does tend to go on the inside of the line a little. Yes! Up, what a delivery, Tanil Peschel gets the big wicket of Rachel Haynes with an absolute peach. Well, what a start. It, certainly creating opportunities, swinging the ball back into the left-hander in Rachel Haynes. The inside edge the ball before, standing the seam up, swinging the ball back in. That is textbook opening bowling inside the power play. Lateral movement make things difficult for the opening batters. Rachel Haynes, one of the best defences in women's cricket. Knocked over, couldn't do anything about it. It's a fantastic wicket. Australia. Jess Jonathan and Darcy Brown has delivered. Great angle that slightly swung back in and we saw one of those against Nick Carey. And that is a very important wicket. Is this the game changing moment for the Adelaide Strikers? It was 45 required by the Heat. Oh yes, that is a beauty. The first two overs, we've seen a little bit of movement. No better than that one. That was a sensational delivery. Marazan Cap, she knows that this is a weakness. Goes wider of the crease as well, which just helps with the angle to hit that top of off stump. Again, smart bowling by the South African international. She likes getting out her countrymen, doesn't she? <laughs> and another dismissal. Phoebe Litchfield, two times in a row, she's been stumped. And Amelia Kerr on fire. Looks like it was the wrong end once again. Turning away from the left-hander and a great piece of wicket-keeping from Redmate. Well, we spoke about how Amelia Kerr had the ability to beat the bat both inside and outside edge. It's, it's fine, Mick. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! oh, yes, you beauty. That is a big one for the Renegades. Have a look at this turn and goes right through. She's almost late on it. That Soph Molyneux is starting yeah! to get her mojo back when it comes to bowling. And that is going to be so crucial for the Melbourne Renegades. It's etched. And the goal on the right hand. Here's Ismail. Sammy Joe Johnson one end. Ismail the other. It is about pace and seam. And the favourites are three for 20. Four overs back to back. You don't often see that, but she has been shaping the ball very well. She's been honing in on that top of off stump, that fourth stump line. Brown again, now balls. Oh, that swings and that has gone through. Another one. Third time we've seen the stump shattered. A massive hooping delivery there from Darcy Brown. And it is Nicola Carey is on her way. And she'll really need to produce a skipper's knock here and get her team on the board with some uh, decent runs. Yes, big job ahead there. So that completes a, another wicket taking over. It is two for seven.